Now we're going to go over how to use voice um, to type for Gboard. And we're also going to go over how to kind of make that feature faster and usable when you're offline and not connected to the internet. So to use voice typing, you can just pull up the keyboard and you hit the microphone here. And then you just kind of click the microphone to stop. And you'll see it started rec um, typing in what I wanted as soon as I hit the the microphone button there. Now if I want to make this faster and accurate and work uh, even when I'm not connected to the internet I'm going to want to go ahead and jump in the settings here and to do that for Gboard we just go ahead and long press on the um, comma key here and you'll see the settings gear pop up. Once that happens we just let go. Once we're in here we're going to go to voice typing and you can see use your voice um, use voice typing is already turned on. You can see faster voice typing. Download faster voice typing on your device. Once downloaded, you can use it offline. Um, it does not take up much room at all. Um, so I do recommend that everyone kind of goes and do, does this. So we'll go ahead and turn it on. And we'll see it's downloading the voice models right now and the information it needs. And once it's done, um, I'll go back and show you that it'll still work even when it's offline. So there, it's fully downloaded. So we'll just go ahead and turn off the Wi-Fi here. So that's off. So this is no longer connected to the internet. There's no data plan or anything on this. So we'll just go ahead and re-pull up the keyboard and try it. So as you can see, it still works offline um, just as well, if not better, as when it did for online. So this is great, especially when you have spotty you know, service or anything like that. Um, it also is faster because it doesn't have to go to the internet to try to understand what you're saying. It can do most of the work right here on the, on the phone itself. So that's how you use voice typing and how you download it for offline use and so it can be a little bit faster when using Gboard. Hopefully that helps.